Okay, so the video I posted just before this one was originally simply to show you guys how annoyed I was with the downloader that Blizzard Entertainment used to give you the downloader for the Diablo 3 demo. However, I have since had another issue. I took that video and then I let the Blizzard downloader go all night. And this is the fourth attempt I've had to download the demo. And it's now most of the way complete. They have really slow servers to begin with. Well, I was on Facebook, and I noticed these advertisements were appearing in the middle of my newsfeed. And I clicked about this ad, and it said something about Jet MP3. And about how I could disable it. So I hit disable, and then I started looking up Jet MP3. Well, when I went to do a uh, search for Jet MP3, I was surprised to find that <clears throat> this appeared at the top, right here, appeared at the top of my results. If you click this right here, you'll notice that if you hit settings, it's presented by Jet MP3, and I'm like, what the fuck is on my computer? Um, upon doing that, I looked down here at the Blizzard downloader and then went back and checked out that video that I made you guys, which is right here, showing that installer. Sure enough, one of the things that I declined was Jet MP3. And yet it installed it anyway, because if you look at this, in my programs and features, I have Jet MP3 installed right here, and it says it was installed on 7.20, which was a little bit after midnight when I took that video and started the download process. Right now, I am pretty dang pissed off at Blizzard Entertainment for providing a shitty downloader that installed something I told it not to install while it was, trying, while it was installing the downloader for Diablo 3, and as a result, I am canceling that download for Diablo 3, and... I am going to be contacting Blizzard and no longer purchasing any of their games at this point in time. That's not acceptable with me at all.